<laughs> Yo, I've been thinking, you know a spot I haven't been to in a long time? The Mall of Millennia. I also have an Apple appointment I gotta go to, so that's what we about to do today. Venture up to the Mall of Millennia, see what's popping, see what's inside the building. I know they only got two sneaker stores, Foot Locker slash House of Hoops and Finish Line. But nevertheless, man, we're gonna make the best out of it, man. So let's get out of here before I miss my appointment. Peace. What's poppin' y'all? Yo, we made it to the Mall Millennia, but I didn't want to push it, man. I literally made it on time. I think uh, my appointment was at 140. I pulled up at um, 139. I think Apple give you like 10 minutes leeway, give or take. But I didn't want to push it, man. Plus, I'm hungry, so I'll decide to pull up the Kiki's. I might eat here first, and then we'll take it to the mall. I rescheduled for an hour later. Is it an hour later? Yeah, hour later, man. So I'm gonna enjoy some meal. Then we'll go to the mall. We'll do that little mall vlog, like I promise y'all, man. I'll right, see y'all in a bit. Peace. All right, y'all, first store, finish line. I haven't been in here, ooh, probably since January. I can't remember the last time I did a, a mall vlog at this spot. But we'll go in here first, see what's popping, see what they got retros. If they got some J's, you already know the routine. So this is pretty much the um, Air Max section right here. You see a whole bunch of Vapor Max, Vapor Max Plus, 270 Reacts, 2090s. I don't even sure what these joints are. Never seen those ever. They got the Air Force ones, but we seen these in the outlet. What they got in here for 140 is the price. And you got these joints. Are these the 2017s, 2015s? Wow, they're still in the building. And they also got some 90s and. 97s. Haven't seen this colorway. 18 is the price. Alright. The 29th is hundred dollars. The only colorway I like for the 29th are these right here. That's about it. And then we slide over, man. We got the Adidas with the MMDs. And I have not seen this color right here. This is funky right here. This yellow and orange though. I'm not mad at it, man. Full length boost. You got the Lego blocks on the side. <laughs> Reminiscent of the OGs. Uh, they did switch it up a little bit, man. They got the whole Adidas branding on the side, on the medial and lateral side, looks like. And they got a pull tab in the back heel as well. I've never, never seen them like that before. I see them like this. See how it's vertical? This one is like landscape. I even know that's the right terminology. Probably not. So I'm just making them. Uh, this one's a little bit different too as well. They got a little hang tag. That's cool. I'm not sure who's right. Oh, that's just probably just for Global Access, JD, all black joint right here as well. That's cool. Whole bunch of Adidas, y'all. Ultra Boost. And then you also got some Champion joints. Oh, the Champion colors don't look that bad. Might be some Sockenese type joints. What they going for? $70 though. Who's rocking this though? I'm curious. Embroidery's crazy. What's up, man? Yeah, yeah, I'm just looking for some shoes. Appreciate it. Embroidery's off the chain, man. I like this right here. You know, they're not gonna get much love. People not gonna rock them, man. You already know how that is. Oh, shoot. Asics, a little bit of patent leather. That's unique. That's definitely unique. Oh, we got the leather joint on top, and then you got the suede. Okay, all right. All right, let's go over here. This is Brooks. Yep. Yeah, I know y'all not interested in those. And then you do have some um, Converse, bro. Wow, I can't get that out. We got Velcro on the side. That's crazy. See what the Converse look like? Then look at the Blazers. Similar shoe, right? Similar style. More Blazers on the left hand side. Puma, all that good stuff. Some Air Force ones. In the black and royal colorway. Not a fan though. I like the style. Don't get me wrong. I like the style. Just so chunky, man. Not something I would rock. I like this chunk because the gun bottom, the rubber band bottom. I like that. Faking you out with the Air Jordan 9 joints. <laughs> Don't remind the Air Jordan 9s. Look at the. I'm sorry. Did I say the 9s? I meant to say the 8s, bro. I apologize. Air Jordan 8s. Look at the tongue. Look at the colorway. A whole bunch of LeBron joints. Okay. Still haven't reviewed this shoe. What are they going for? The 140? I can't remember what I paid for. Maybe not 110, maybe. Let's check it out. I like this Jordan T, yo. Vintage looking T with that wash. That gray wash. Dope, man. But look what it's hitting for, though. 50 beans, bro. But I like it, though. I like it. Yo, peep these, yo. Remember the shoes I've been dissing for a long time, but I'm starting to like now. These basketball shoes, never realized why they're so high in price. But look at this color though, man. This is definitely unique. I have not seen this colorway. I definitely will hoop in this shoe. It's 145, man. So that's kind of pricey in my personal opinion. Then you got the PG. PGs, I apologize. You got the Greek Freak 2s for 85. Stupid love. Especially shoes just came out. 13s and the black end. Right? Tripping, y'all. I know he skipped the year because he didn't play ball. You got the black end. Red joints. You got the Just On wannabes. That's what this reminds me of. They're going for retail game. 150 is the price. And then over here. Oh, this also, I haven't seen this colorway. 
Free Freak shoes for a black and purple joint. I've seen that. And they got their white joint right there as well. Old school Grand Hills back in the 90s. The Myersons. James Harden's, bro. And it's all red colorway. We're hitting for 130 is the price, man. Kind of heavy, but I'm wondering if that's because that shoe one. I like it though. I like the original pair, man. That Futurama. I like that pair better. Um, how much left in here? We probably been the corner in the back. I did see these in the outlet. They're not creeping up in there. But that was still I saw them in. But they're, they're in the outlets. Maybe it was a celebration outlet. They got the raid, right done. Scare raids. Y'all yeah, watched my other videos the other day. I went to the finish line. And I saw a pair of these with the white midsole. So I know I wasn't tripping, man, because I thought. It was an all gold pair, and that's what it is. This is all gold pair. Another pair must be a new pair. They had a white midsole, and I'm like, that's strange. That's not what I remember it looks like. It's still going from 180, though. You pass in. That fell. Dropping shoes, even finish line. Boost is down here. Adidas joint. Nothing else crazy. This was actually the shoe right here. The golden white pair I told y'all guys about with the white midsole. This is it right here. 180. That was a men's shoe. I guess it was both women and, and men. I just haven't seen it in the men's side, though. That's it. All right, child, so we left finish line. Wasn't really much popping inside there, so we about to take our challenge to a uh, house of hoop, which is like around the corner, man. So let's go inside and see what's popping. Um, B, we got the Air Jordan 1 metallic navy. I wish I had time to put these laces in, man. These metallic blue laces that came with the metallic blue pair. Damn it. Or rather, the navy blue laces. Very comfortable shoe. You already know Jordan 1s. I've been collecting Jordan 1 for the last five years, probably six. And this is one of my favorite all white Air Jordan 1 metallic navy, even though I don't wear it as much as I should. Leave me a comment if you guys cop this, and if you did, did you buy it day one? Did you cop yours on sale? And if you did, where you purchase it from, and how much you paid? All right, House of Hoops, Foot Locker, y'all see it? What are these right here? Jordans? I have never seen those. See, they look like kids, so. The other praise the blue one. I haven't seen these joints ever, man. They're Jordan 1 Miz 85 on the back. Apparently this is orange, I thought it was red. Orange outsole, orange swoosh. Okay, 85 on the back here. And the other colorway, the other shoe, the right shoe is blue. And it still got some Carmines, y'all. Y'all want some Carmines? The midsole on this look pretty good, man. Look all white. Doesn't even look faded, pinkish or nothing, y'all. They're going for 140 if y'all care for them. I'm back on the shelf. Now we're in House of Hoop now. Here's the lows. That's pretty much all the retros I see in here, but you'll peep this. I have not seen this one right here. Is it 90? The 100 beans. This is the all star, all black patent leather low. I got the high, which I have not disclosed or shown or reviewed on this channel. I actually like this. You already know. I'm gonna have to cop this off the shrimp, man. $100? I'll send the high. Just ask them if they have it before we do that. Actually, and they also got the bread joints, black and red lows. The 90 though. You already know I had two pairs of this. I got rid of one of them, give it to you guys. And then they also got the this all white joint. Something similar to the pair I got from, uh, from Cool Kicks. He sent me a pair from, I guess, the Foot Locker off of Broadway in California. The only like 600 something pairs made. Some odds look similar to that. The fun little difference after doing a little research and you guys hit me up, it looks like the midsole come apart. It gets revealed. So that's dope. But anyway, she's checking right now to see if that shoe's available in my size. Yo, peep this, man. People asked if I was getting this pair. This joint right here, the black and white and red Air Raids. I told them no. Kindly, respectfully said no. Don't care for it, man. I just care about the old GP I had. That was actually my first Nike basketball shoe. Not this color, obviously, but the original, the black and gray joint, which I copped. 
And they still got the Ray-Bans here, that's obvious. What you say? Okay. Oh, the Prime Outlets? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, 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 I know exactly where it's at. Yeah. That's, all right, cool, thank you. So, Prime Outlets have it, so we'll be venturing over there. Hope this vlog's not too long, man. I'll probably do a pickup vlog for that. All right, man, so Air Race, Ray Guns, still going for 145. I saw on the finish line, so I just left, they had a pair, the kids pair, for cheaper. They're going for $80 now, but not adults pairs. So then you got the penny joints. In the laney colorway the black event a whole bunch of blazers suede premium leather air forces now i haven't seen this air force this is crazy y'all rocking this though i mean air force is going crazy right now almost like a hologram man passing on this though and then what else oh they got the um ray gun Kyrie sevens more Kyrie sevens Kyrie lows Kyrie sixes freak freaks lebron 16s lebron 18s i'm sorry LeBron 17 lows, 17 lows, LeBron 18s. What is this? PG5? PG4? PG5s, I was right originally. Light as hell, bro. This one is so light, so light. And below, okay. Thanks. So. Oh, wow, this still got these? Who's buying these at 350? Pricey. Very pricey. Before I get out of here, man, I'll show y'all some Air Maxes, man. Um, they don't really got big of a selection, so I'm gonna be real selective. I'll show you like this one right here. It's like an OG colorway, but it's not though. Um, I like it. It's going for 160, 2090. And they got different flavors there. For these pluses, are they pluses or tens? Tens. They're going for 119. Not much there, man. Anyways, I gotta get out of here because I gotta go to my uh, my appointment. So my appointment at the Apple Store is at one. Yeah, right now I'm in the line at the Apple Store. Hopefully, I can get this freaking cover replaced. Yo. <laughs> Uh, yo, they actually opened the Apple store, man. It's wide open, man. Last time I came here to pick up, like, for Christmas, pick up my wife's gifts and stuff, man. It was very limited. You couldn't even, like, go into the store, into the store, man. Now it's, like, wide open. Everyone is back shopping, touching the products and whatnot. So that's dope. So I'm in the store, y'all. Trying to get this change. Let's see if I can get a different color, man, because this is not cutting it, bro. This is not cutting it, man. It's just as a, the dial of my jeans is causing this. And I'm not disagreeing with that. I think exactly that's the case, man. But, you know, we got to wear jeans. So I could just see this happening. All right, y'all. So I just left the Apple store. Got my case recovered. Got an all black case. Got rid of the California poppy seed. Yellow faded. <laughs> what you gonna call it? But um, I do got one more stop I got to make. Which is the outlet, but it's not the Nike outlet. It's the Foot Locker. I'm gonna try to get those lows. They got a pair there, but it told me it's closing early at four. I called, they didn't pick up the phone, so I don't know what this is gonna look like. Anyways, man, let's get out of here. Yo, Foot Locker is closed, man. Damn, it's closed. I looked, I peeked through the window just to see if they had uh, the shoe I was looking for. I saw the the breads, the bread lows, but I didn't see the black and the black All Star lows. Didn't see that. Don't mean they don't have it. I just didn't see it from the distance I was at. But anyways, 